വ്യക്തത ചിന്തയില്ലേ വിതച്ച വിത്തല്ല ഭൂമിയുടെ അടിയിൽ അടിച്ചു താഴ്ത്തി പക്ഷേ മഴ വന്നു സൂര്യൻ ഉദയിച്ചു പെട്ടെന്ന് വിത്തുകളെ മുളച്ചു Certainly the truth will arise. Jesus said, I am the way, I am the truth, and I am the life. I am the way, I am the truth, and I am the life. I am the way, I am the truth. We cannot crucify the truth forever. 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 Jesus said, വിക്ടറി ഓവർ ഡെത്ത് ഓൺ ഗുഡ് ഫ്രൈഡേ where they declares that it is the victory of evil but on easter sunday the world declares it is it is the victory over the evil let me repeat that things dukkavalli aicha logam vijarichu thinma shaktiyude vijayam aayikkum it is the victory of evil but on the easter sunday where it declares it is the victory over the evil tinma shaktiyude melulla vijayamana easter kaal dukkhamalyaacha tinma shaktiyude vijayamaa enna uyarpil na kaanunade tinma shaktiyude mel devam vijayichu ennalla early morning on the first day of the week that is easter sunday mary magdalene and other women went to the tomb with spices to pay the last homage for jesus burial when other disciples ran away mary magdalene took a bold step she faced so many difficulties but he she reached there and mary magdalene and other ladies women so the stone was removed from the tomb but they reached there the angel said to the women at the empty tomb why do you look for the living among the dead valare dukkathode yesuvine thailam pushanayittu the burial nu vendi chennada chenna pol they could not see jesus and the angel said to them why do you look for jesus living he is living among the dead this is a question we are hearing day by day they are looking for jesus they want to see the dead christ but the angel said he is living among the dead he has risen we are also looking christ among the dead in our day to day life situation we are looking or chasing for the red crust but he is risen he has gone before you at galilee that was the message given by angel to the women so on this occasion what does the resurrection mean to us in the earthly help namukku thalunna artham endan sandesha let me share uh, four things based on this base i have already read before you the first uh, message of the first day of the resurrection is affirmation endana 
Christ Jesus said, that is the affirmation. There is no doubt. Christ Jesus said, that was the given the message. He is not here at the tomb. The resurrection of Jesus is the central point of the Christianity. The empty tomb of Jesus replaced Christ risen. Christ is risen. Really. Without the empty tomb, Christianity is empty. Without the Orinya Kandare Lengil, Christian Marku empty. Empty tomb says Jesus is not present there. Dwelling place of Jesus is in our human hearts. The empty tomb could not hold Jesus for a longer time. The stone could not hold Jesus for a longer time. But he was raised from the dead. What is your country? Manisha Rayanglana. Yes, she will depart. For human hearts is the dwelling place of risen Christ. Do we open our hearts to receive Jesus in our life? If we look in the world, many great leaders like Buddha, Confucius, in Kerala, Gurusami, in India, Mahatma, so many leaders have come, lived, and go. And they were buried. But they are not our contemporary. They never came back. But only Jesus was able to rise from the dead. This Jesus is contemporary to you and me. He is with us. He lives and moves among us. He is living in the hearts of the people. His victory over the death proves that he has the power of forgive, to transform and to give eternal life on those who put their trust in him. So the first imperative of the Easter is the empty tomb of Jesus promises the hope of eternal life. The empty cross of Jesus gives the forgiveness of sins. On the altar we have an empty cross, not a crucifix we are using. What does it mean? The empty cross gives us the meaning Jesus has forgiven our sins. But the empty tomb gives us, Jesus has promised the eternal life. Nitti Jeevan Namak promise the empty tomb honor because Christ is the same. The second message of resurrection is fear not. That is the one in Bereji. Amen. Today, today we are living in the veil of uncertainties. Their economic, global recession, increasing unemployment, the global warming, epidemic diseases such as HIV, in India, Kerala, Dengue Penny and Chicken Guinea. In America, we can notice soil food and Andhra, so many epidemic diseases. We are afraid of that thing. The rise of religious fanaticism and terrorism. The moral and spiritual pollution, wherever we can see that. The moral and spiritual degradation. And increasing broken families. Day by day, the broken families are increasing. 
that is the threatening experience in our community. In this condition, there is a question arises. If there is hope in such a death-like situation, even if there are suffering, then there will be protection. The answer to the question is yes. We are living the world of uncertainties. We are afraid of so many things, but the resurrection. of christ gives us there is a hope ide pratyashi illa anubhavam illa pratyashiyude anubhavam on the day of resurrection the disciples gathered to the in a locked room fear of the jews and listen christ appeared to them and said peace be with you after the session disciples afraid of the jews so they were in the locked room jesus appeared there the risen christ promised so a uh, promise that our fears are groundless and baseless because christ is the same the third message of resurrection is come and see but many the mother and other women went to the disciples and said there is peace you come and see the christ is the same the come and go are the two important words in the bible variya poguga rendu pradhana petta vaakkala if you look in the book of genesis at the time before the flood of Noah invited the people come into the ark. But that day, the prophecy came. Varya, for the word promise, Varya, it will come and buy fruit. Now what can I? So Christianity is a religion of experience. But I never have a man. 